shit, shit, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Hey, man, shit, what's, shit. What, hey, what's going on? I was looking at our numbers, how many people downloaded our app, how much processing power we had available, and that's when I saw it. It, what, it, what? A chunk of our followers and bots came from inactive or dead invite accounts. Hey, wait, so someone used a social media site to boost our numbers? Who? And how many fucking accounts, I man? don't know who, but it came from inside invite. Someone with admin access, I'm sure of that. As for how many... Fuck Sorry. Me. Sorry, I didn't check. It's... No, it's all my fault. I didn't check. Josh, no, I didn't not check. You know, maybe someone inside invite is a fan. Yeah, or maybe we're getting set up to get fucked. Check. We need to find out. Marcus. Find your way inside. I should have I just Josh, checked. Josh, it's not your fault, okay? Look, we all saw the numbers. You're the only one who caught it. You did good. You did good. Huh? Okay. Sorry about that. Este... I'm sending you the flagged accounts. Use the CEO's computer, Mary Catskill. She's on vacation, so her office should be empty. Oh, damn it, I'm sorry. Oh, I, I didn't see you there. Whoever sent me this is gonna friggin' pay! Run home now!
Is everything gonna break down today? I unlocked the elevator. Heading there now. Heading up. I'm gonna get us some answers. Good luck, Marcus. We're with you. I'm in. Trying to figure out who boosted our numbers. Whoa, whoa. What happened? The flag clients just vanished. We lost the bots. What did you do? Nothing. This isn't me. I... Marcus, is this a bad time? Sort of feels like a bad time. And she drinks it with ice. I don't really need to introduce myself, do I? I know who you are. That night at the beach, man, I knew you looked fucking familiar. You well, know, Venus must have been in retrograde or some bullshit because I think it was fate that I was in the night that you hacked into our system. I had to meet you, and there you were, pissing on your sneakers. All brains and no aim. What's Bloom's CTO doing in the office of the CEO of Invite? And why'd you boost our numbers? Uh, this is the part where you offer me a six-figure salary? <laughs> no, fuck no. No, no, no. You could coat circles around most of my programmers, no, see, I can't pitch uh, CTOS 2.0 as a state-of-the-art security system and then hire someone that's on the no-fly list. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I just came here to have a drink. But hey, if you want to have a drink and a dance, I'm in. Oh, you think it's a fucking joke? Do it. Roll a fucking punch. <laughs> you got everybody eating out your fucking hands thinking the system's bulletproof? You can't see the people you're stepping on. Guess what, Marcus? Guess what? The people want to be told who is good and who is bad. They don't care how it works, only that it does. But it doesn't fucking work. A few fucking civilian casualties is the cost you have to pay for the betterment of the world. You're fighting a war no one gives a shit about. Now they're just swimming upstream right into the grizzly's mouth. So why'd you prop up dead sex numbers? There's no one in Silicon Valley who could throw a proper punch. Ah, and you're a great investment. You're so aggressive, so indignant. You frightened the rest of Silicon Valley right to my doorstep. You use us to sell CTOS 2.0 to them. What is the ultimate deterrent against hackers like you? And how? Everyone needs my protection. So, here it is, Marcus. Your record is back on file. Your backdoor access is plugged. And those bots I gave you, they're gone. Oh, 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 and there's a warrant out for your arrest. Hacking, corporate espionage, and breaking and entering. It's okay. I was done with it anyway. Surrounding the building, get pissed later and get out now. I repeat, come out with your hands up. All right, all right, I'm, I'm gone.
Marcus, it's getting too hot out there for you. Come back. We'll figure this out together. It's not that bad. We look like a bunch of chumps. Stop! Fucking damn it! Wrench, calm the fuck down. It's not helping. Yeah, you're right. It's not helping. Marcus, you got anything to say? Well, guys, I, to be honest with you, uh, I genuinely don't have a plan. But I got an idea, and... I don't know, just trust me on this one. Here we go! <gasps> oh, Thank good you. for you, Wrench! <laughs> I know things haven't been great lately. Yeah, <laughs> they suck. But whatever shit we're in now, that's now. You helped us find our voice. We took on the Giants and had one motherfucker of a run. Never thanked you for any of it. Hey, why are you talking like it's over? Isn't it? I'm still in. I know you are, and we can convince the others that... You're not in? These are from our DeadSec channels. DeadSec is not worthy. DeadSec is a bunch of skiddies. You told us lies and bullshit. Hashtag dead suck. Yeah, so we got some shit stirrers. Who cares what they think? Who cares what they... Jesus, Marcus. Have you been paying attention? I care what they think. I've worked my ass off for years, trying to earn us respect long before you ever showed up. This is my brand. Now it's completely fucked. So unfuck it. I don't know if I can. Uh, well, if it makes you feel any better, at least you're not a fugitive. <laughs> oh, damn. I wonder if there's a bounty on your head. 
Maybe I can salvage this. Oh, please, man. You couldn't catch me if you wanted oh, to. Oh, you're talking to a track star, bitch. Just walk. Yeah. Yeah? I don't want to hurt anything. Yeah, me neither. If I gotta drag their asses out to the middle of the desert to keep DedSec together, I'm gonna do it. DedSec's come too far to give up now. Swelter Skelter's third annual Jabberwock Hacking Challenge begins soon at the Center Sculpture. Come show us what you got. What? This isn't a fair fight. Oh, it's so not fair. Little guy's gonna get the shit kicked out of him. But that's what makes it fun, right? We like to watch little guy take his lumps. Yeah. I mean, so he can get back up on his feet again and overcome, right? You're trying to turn this into a metaphor for DedSec, aren't you? I mean, if you want to keep DedSec going, I'm right there with you. But if you're putting your metaphor money on that weirdo, no. He's going down and staying down. <laughs> yeah, it's a long shot. Hey, are you joining us for the competition? Yep, I'm down. Josh, who's your friend? Oh, this is Susan. She's a second grade teacher from Milwaukee. She's 32 and she drives a cherry red. Cool. Hey, we're gonna meet by the big sculpture for a group shot before the challenge. Um, whenever you're ready. Didn't mean to, uh, step on your game here. Game? Uh, we're not playing a game. I was just explaining to Susan how if your low speed mixture adjustment is too rich, your engine's going to buckle under all the excess fuel. That's a four cycle idle and that can be a no-no. Yep, sure can. Okay, well, I'll see you out there. Leaving your mark? Always. But not dead sex. Doesn't feel right, you know? Come on, don't bum me out here. I'm trying to have a good time. Me too. So we, as in dead sex we, are gonna enter that hacking challenge and we're gonna win. And the others are okay with this? They will be. I got a nice smile. Well, you do have a nice smile. <laughs> See? No problem. We're gonna do this. Everything's gonna be okay. You've got it all figured out, huh? Nah, but I do know if I get you back in Satara mode, You'll figure out most of it for me. <laughs> Damn. You are dangerous. <laughs> Meet us by the ugly sculpture when you're ready. All right. See you there. Hey, man, what you working on? Gonna get these people moving. But they need a proper track list. This shit barely has a pulse. DJ ratio. Just ratio. Back when I used to do sets. Hey, maybe I'll go back to it. What else am I gonna do now? Man, dead sex not over. We hit a pothole, that's all. We're gonna come back stronger. You're always so sure of yourself. I know. But I'm always right. Wait, wait, wait. Here we go. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's much better. Locked their DJ out of his tools, too. The savior of the party. Hey, once you're done giving these guys a hard time, meet me in the middle. Dead sex entering a competition. I'll be there. Competitors, this is the last call to enter the Jabberwock Hacking Challenge. Last call, third act of the Merchant of Vengeance. That's us. All right, people, gather up. We need a group shot. Hey, try to look pretty for the camera, huh? Always. Okay, looks like the challenge is starting. Hey, Josh, get on the numbers and feed it answers. Wrench, you got the Jabberwock. Get it wired up and ready. Ratio, I need you to run interference on arrivals. Slow him down. Satara and I are gonna hack this thing. <laughs> Let's get it. Dead set. Let's go, guys.
Drone's up there if you need a better view. Almost I'm there. I'm inside. Okay, what is this? <laughs> nice. Throwing up the horns and punctuating them. We should focus. There seems to be a timer. Think you can hack it? Of course. Stop fucking moving. Don't mess with Zatara. Multiply by Juice in it's gonna ah. hey, you kids want to feed your heads? Two ounces of sacrosanct mind fuck. Man, people, I am going offline now. See you on the other side. Oh, Horatio, you good, man? The word good has lost all meaning, my friend. Mm. Okay, you good? Mm. Did I forget to mention that these boomers had a little acid bath? Uh, Josh? It's okay, they're using hallucinogens in clinical trials for... Aspies. Mass... Aspies. <laughs> Josh is feeling it. Okay, let's go find something for you to stare at. Huh? <laughs> okay. Okay. Nah. You're not Ray. You were Ray, Raymond Kinney Ray. I, I still got your old hacker zines, man. I remember reading War Driver and gearing up my 10 speed, backpack with an antenna. Shit, I even used your old root kit, man. Fuckster? Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> well, I assumed you were all just skitty pests. Correct me if I'm wrong, but. Your crew seems to have a lot of unfocused noise. You the leader? The fine world. <sighs> no, nah, man, it doesn't work like that. Dead sex got a rule. No personal armies, no leaders. Yeah. Well, FYI, I saw you leading out nah, there. Man, this is everything we're fighting against. The system back home is completely fucked. And any kid out there on the sand is gonna say the exact same fucking thing. Easy words, bro. Easy words. All right. A few years ago, this broken-ass system marked me as a criminal risk. Linked me to some shit I didn't even do because it was probable. And now, with CTOS, it's everywhere. I mean, I, I can see it down to the... <laughs> the to the sub subliminal shit. You just multiply. Yeah, we have a tendency to do that. 
What you call subliminal is a bellwether, Marcus. You got a sharp eye, kid. But subliminal is passive. Bellwether program is control. It's like a Orwell Huxley double punch. Profile. Media manipulation, corporate collusion, consumerism, all driven by predictive algorithms. And now, it's setting up shop in the heart of the Silicon Valley. And somebody at Bloom's using CTOS to feed it data. Over Kruken. Fuck up, let's go. Yeah, man. Uh, I just spent the night in a pup tent next to a lady who was very nude and very tattooed. Fuck good for you, girl. No, you don't get it, man. She was the son's of Ragnarok bride. I guess we gotta go, man. We gotta fucking vamoose now. Come on. Fucking sons are coming. Oh, God. So you said you guys fucked up. How bad is it? Yeah, we all at risk now because my name's got a red flag on it. Yeah, people are gonna start making the connections. Yeah, where the fuck is everyone? Is that all? It's enough. We talking about Bloom here. Hey, and you're talking to Bloom's public enemy number one, son? Yeah, I've been dodging those bastards for years. If you want, I could scrub you from the system. Give me a couple hours. Just like that? Well, I might have to sacrifice a goat as part of my arcane ritual, but yeah, just like that. <laughs> there you are. We've been looking for you all morning. Turns out Swelter Skelter doesn't have a lost and found. <laughs> nah, it's more of a finder's keeper's policy out there in the desert. What in the hell is he doing here? Yeah, Marcus, why did you invite this stranger into our house? Look, look, it just happened, all right? We were running from these bikers, right? And... <laughs> Look, you know what? It doesn't even matter. He's cool. Oh, he's cool. Well, that's good. Because we usually discuss these things as a group. I know. It's my bad. But you met Ray already, right? I want to introduce you to Raymond Kinney. That's Raymond Kinney? I thought you'd be cleaner. Yeah, I get that a lot. Can I have a hug? Um, yeah, I have a two-second group. <clears throat> I get this a lot, too. Can we keep him like a hacker in residence? Yeah, we could use his help. He should... He can he, he can stay here, right? He should... He should stay here. Okay, fine. But if he fucks with any of us, I'm gonna pop his nuts like ripe grapes. Message received. Nice hat. Nice mask. Okay, we're good. You want a beer? Uh, yeah. I would love a beer. Or two. Oh, thank you. Grab the man some hardware, too. He's gonna teach us some magic.
provider of smart houses in the Bay Area is facing allegations that it violated homeowner privacy. Leaked documents reveal that home... Hey kid, ready to change the world? I got some for you. <laughs> hey, yo, T Bone. I'm ready, man. I'm pumped. No, seriously, activist mode, activate. Hey, man, how do we get Bloom? <laughs> <laughs> what? Hold on to your joystick, son. You kids are gonna need to work your way up to Bloom, even with me help. Bray, are you briefing him without me? We were supposed to do that together. Oh, uh, no, I just didn't want to trouble you. What trouble? No trouble. Come on, Marcus, let's brief. Okay. So, let's... let's look at the big shot data harvester. Our friends at Noodle. Now, every time you search for a discount refrigerator or bulldozer porn, they learn more and more about you. Data profiling 101. Right. But what you didn't know was that Bloom's already got their grubby paws all over that data. Oh, shit. Oh, this is good, Sitara. Noodle's data is just what Bloom needs to strengthen the bellwether. Dig their puppet strings in deeper. You know, if we could get a hold of this ammunition, we could take down a whole lot of different targets. I could help with that. You can't hack Noodle unless you get into the server farm. You can't get into the server farm without clearance. Hell, you can't even get on the grounds unless you're an employee there. Who the hell you think Rob Zombie over here gets his intel from? Well, tell me you got clearance. Psst. Oh, man, I'm trying to stay low-key right now. One of my leads is breathing down my neck. I bet you Marcus can pose as an employee. Oh, he could do more than pose as an employee, Sitara. Tell him what you told me, Horatio. Noodle buses. I snagged an exploit for credentials. I could get you to the buses. All you gotta do is drive it in. They'll think you're one of the bus drivers. Shit. Yo, let's roll, son. All right. Hey. <laughs> mm -hmm. Let's do this. Hey.
Hey, there's a changing room out back. I appreciate it. All right. You ready? Let's roll. See that? No, that's... Uh-huh. No, I, I don't think so. Yeah. You call me? Yeah. She told her boss. in the parking lot driver leaves it there every day to get his coffee beautiful all right man let me just say right off the top i apologize for anything and everything you're about to see you kidding i'm getting an inside look at your alter ego horatio carlin corporate code jockey why do i get the feeling this whole thing was a bad idea it's cool i'll go easy on you It's the GPS. Hey, sit, sit down. I got it, man. Come all right, on. all right, just... All right. GPS. I don't know where the GPS is. Up, up. Got it. There you go. Okay. Good, Gary. Hey there. Hey. Horatio! What are you doing first on the bus? What can I say? I'm an eager beaver. Anyway, the juicing has really turned my life around. I feel lighter, my mind freer. I hate to break it to you, but juicing doesn't do squat. And you haven't tried my juice. I'm serious. What you want is the pulp. That's the healthy part. Juicing extracts all that. All you're drinking is sugar, smoothies. Now that's where it's at. Load them up with fruit, veg, superfoods. Superfoods? Yeah, like goji berries, maca powder, all that good stuff. You have a lot to learn. You know the science behind superfoods is shaky at best. Well, they're health foods. You can't argue that. Yeah, but... 
Yeah, but goji berries are as much a superfood as grapes are. It's a marketing buzzword designed to rope in consumers. No offense. Mm, awkward. You know, Marcus, there are times when I wish I was out doing what you're doing. And then there's today. Thanks, friend. I'm freaking choking on the pretentiousness in here. And here I thought Bloom employees were bad. Oh my god, this is brutal! Hey? Hey there! Oh, oh yeah! You stayed late last night? Yeah. Yeah, and the catering made me want to puke. I'd rather starve next time. This new sushi place is so not up to par. The soy sauce was so bland. My spicy tuna roll was anything... The entertainment. My spice... What the hell? What? Holy... Drugs, man. Oh, okay. My spicy tuna roll was anything but. Oh, man, that is literally the worst. Literally? I could think of some worse things. <laughs> Shh. Oh, yeah, that you are like high. Good time, Lily. What? Oh, yeah, what you are high. Thing? Horatio, man, I'm scared, bro. What, what is it? Don't nobody look like us. Oh, man, welcome to Silicon Valley. Hey, what do you call a black man surrounded by thousands of white people? What? Mr. President. Hey, man, they see two of us together, they gonna think we plotting. We are plotting. Man, I feel so... Exposed. Hey, Horatio. Yeah, welcome to my world. There's only three other black people that work here. Two guys. That's rough. But hey, you're fighting a good fight, changing the face of corporate life in the valley. <laughs> you haven't experienced corporate life until you're the only brother in a meeting and have to represent all of Blackdom. Jesus. If I had a nickel. Covering 30 acres. The new campus is both private. If I had a nickel for every time someone complimented me for being well-spoken. <laughs> so where's the server farm? Not here, I'm afraid. The whole thing's located under the Noodle Maps building. You'll need a whole other level of clearance to get in there. The managers upstairs can take care of that for you. Just do a repeat performance of the bus hack on one of them, and you're good to go. Let's hit the kitchen. Need fuel before another day. Hey, uh, do you want a coffee? Uh, no, I'm fine. Oh, please, help yourself to a pomegranate. There to die for. You're so great. Thank you so much. Okay, neato. Carlin. Brody. Big day today, huh? I'm excited. How about you? You know, you could just tell us what you've been up to. Where you've been looking, who you've been talking trying to. Trying to get a coffee, you What was that? Just trying to get a coffee. Yeah. Yeah, all right. I'm sure you'll be more forthcoming with HR. <laughs> Enjoy that coffee. Watch it! Are you new here? Yeah. Hmm. Punk would love to lay his ass out. I can't stand that mother... Hey, Becky. Gentlemen. He's been watching my ass since the day I got here. Now he's saying I should be more forthcoming with HR? You think he's got something on you? Damn it. Do you have any idea how much jail time I'd be looking at? 
If I can get into the server farms, I can delete all that shit, all right? We got your back. You're not going in jail. I'll be in touch. All right? All right. All right. All right, Horatio, what's the plan for getting to the Noodle server farm? Best option is the elevator maintenance area on the second floor of Noodle Maps, but watch yourself. Security's tight. More than half Even I don't have access. No sweat. Welcome to the Noodle Campus. 